Washington, President Joe Biden is nearly tied with former President Donald Trump among Minnesota voters in the matchup for the White House. According to a new poll from Min Post Embold Research, respondents favored Biden over Trump by 45 to 42. But that's within the poll's 2.6 margin of error. The poll's results suggest the Biden campaign can't afford to take for granted a state that has voted for the Democratic presidential nominee since 1972. What this means is Biden needs to campaign here, Hamlin University political science professor David Schultz said of the poll results. It also means Biden campaign will have divert resources from other states, including Wisconsin, shore up support in Minnesota, which is key Midwestern Blue Wall campaign needs win 2024 election, Still, the Min Post Embold research poll showed Biden with more support in Minnesota than several recent national polls and polls in five of six swing states. These polls show Biden's support falling below Trump's. Ross Baker, a political science professor at Rutgers University, said the Min Post Embold research poll is in line with other recent polls assessing a rematch between Biden and Trump. He also said the current situation could change. People haven't decided yet and campaigns aren't very active. The Min Post Embold research poll, like other polls, showed a large gender gap in presidential preference in Minnesota. 56% of women surveyed and only 35% of men said they supported Biden. Meanwhile, only 32% of Minnesota women and 53% of men surveyed said they supported Trump. There is also an age difference. Young Minnesotans ages 18 to 34 support Biden over Trump by 47 to 34. Biden also has a strong advantage among voters 65 and older. Schultz said bad news for Biden is that voters in age group that supports president most. Participate in election least embold research pollster Ben Greenfield said Biden's support among young voters in Minnesota has waned since 2020, when they gave the president an 18-point advantage over Trump. So while Biden is still ahead among voters under 50 and by double digits among voters under 35, he has lost some ground based on his 2020 performance, Greenfield said. The poll showed Biden had a large advantage among college-educated voters in the state, especially women, while Trump was favored by those who did not attend college. College-educated women could provide Biden with the biggest support in the state, while 71% of college-educated women said they supported Biden. Only 19% said they supported Trump. So Schultz said place that could swing the state in Biden's favor is Twin Cities suburbs that are home to these female voters, including Edina, Eden Prairie, Golden Valley and Minnetonka. The poll also showed Biden has much more support in the state's urban areas, while Minnesota's rural communities remain Trump country. Trump has a huge lead over GOP rivals' negative views about direction of Sioux.